Hi everyone, welcome to another vlog with Tisha. I am here because one of the viewers had asked me last week when I uploaded my video of my house and how messy it is because we had ordered a whole bunch of new furniture but it hasn't come in yet and so everything is all over the place. One of the viewers had asked me to make a clean and organize with me video, which is a great idea because now that I am trying to organize my stuff and, you know, put my clothes away, trying to find places for things until the furniture comes, this is a great opportunity for me to sit down and find out which clothes I wear, which ones I don't, which ones I like, and which ones I need to get rid of. So I am excited to share with you uh, the method that I have discovered and how I'm going to organize my house and my bedroom when the furniture comes. Oh, if you guys hear any rattling in the background, it's because the dogs are playing. <laughs> so I discovered the Marie Kondo way of tidying up, which I thought was a brilliant idea. Uh, one of my biggest gripes about doing the laundry and folding things and putting them away is that if I want a shirt that's on the bottom, I'm struggling with balancing on one foot, trying to get that t-shirt, and then pulling it out, not messing up the whole pile. She suggests storing all of your shirts and clothing in a vertical manner, which is great. However, for me, trying to put those clothes in the drawer in a vertical way is just gonna be so difficult. So I thought to myself, how can I change that up. How can I store my clothes vertically so that it makes it easier for me to do the laundry, fold the clothes, and put them away, <laughs> and still keep tidy. So I discovered these boxes, these tote boxes that sit nicely into the drawers, and I'm going to be using this to store all my clothes in, and then when it's time to do the laundry and fold new clothes, I can take I can take this out with you know my chin and shoulder and then fold the clothes put them away and then slide this back into the drawer which makes it super easy and I don't have to balance on one leg to do it so behind me here I've got a huge pile of clothes that I had pulled out they're all clean and fresh and these are just things that I had in my drawers and in the laundry that need to be put away and I know that there are some things in here that I either don't wear or that I don't need. But there are also a bunch of stuff that I absolutely love. So let's get started. You guys, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick up an item and I'm gonna ask myself, is this something I wear? Does it give me joy? Um, which I think is a great idea. So I'm gonna keep these shorts and then I'm just gonna go through and and pick out some clothing. Now, I love this I love this dress, but I discovered that I really don't like spaghetti straps. Um, so, thank you. I'm going to let this one go. Okay, so that didn't take as long as I thought it was gonna be, and I'll show you what I've got. So over here, I've got my get rid of pile. It's not as much as I thought it was gonna be, but it turns out that I actually wear a lot more of my clothes than I thought I did. Over here is my keep pile. So what I did here is I went ahead and I organized all of the clothes that I'm going to keep and what I have here are my t-shirts. I wanted to do those first and show you how I'm going to fold them to fit in this box. So, I'm just going to lay it on the floor.
think that's how she does it. And then one. So I'm almost done. The whole process of folding up all of my t-shirts and putting them in this tote took me about 15 minutes altogether. And so, I mean, I was really surprised how quickly I was able to do that. So this is what it looks like. Everything is neatly in its place. And even though I probably didn't fold as perfectly as I could, I was trying to do it uh, as quickly as possible for the sake of this video. But even at that, this still seems very organized and tidy. So I'm so happy with this. And as soon as I get my dresser in, I will be able to fit these into my drawers and be super clean and tidy and be ready to go. Um, I've got a lot of work to do. I'm sure you don't want to sit here and watch me for the next, uh, hour and a half folding clothes. So um, when I am completely finished and have everything in the drawers, I will show you as soon as possible. Uh, but until then, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and leave me a comment below. I wanna know how do you keep tidy? How do you keep your house clean and your laundry perfectly <laughs> folded and finished? Okay, so I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.